Okay, look, I know you expect me to launch into some huge scientific explanation about how antimatter and matter can exist without colliding and annihilating. But really, it's just, you know, the comics writers didn't know what antimatter was, and so, you know, they're like, Bizarro is made out of antimatter, and, and blah blah blah. Except I have my own headcanon for this, which actually makes things make sense. So Bizarro's whole thing is that everything is opposite, right? Everything Bizarro does comes from basically opposite land. Back in the old days, he would say yes when he meant no and, and stuff like that, you know? So, Bizarro is made out of antimatter, but he's made out of Bizarro antimatter. And antimatter in the Bizarro universe acts like matter. Because, you know, it's opposite land. Yes means no. <laughs> if positive is negative and negative is positive in Bizarro land, then antimatter in Bizarro land should just interact with matter the same way that matter interacts with matter in our universe. With whatever little tiny atomic differences they may have.